You're the only one who can use Dreamlight to open this door. Inside, you'll discover a kitchen with a very surprising little chef. Let's do it. <laughs> Magnifique! <laughs> That's French for magnificent, you know. And it's magnificent you can now visit the world of Ratatouille. Thank you. Very kind. Are you coming with me, Wally? Hmm. Is the rat French in the film? Does the rat talk? Whoa. Look at this place. It's so nice. I feel like I'm in a cooking sim. Oh, it's in the chest. Some more clothes. Boop. Black slacks. <laughs> no, why is it not the chef's hat or something? Oh, what's that glowing? Oh, then it disappeared. Interesting. Let's wait. Meet the rat. Paperback. Thank you so much for the two months resub. And you can cook in here too. He doesn't have a French accent. I've never seen it. Oh, uh, hello, human I don't know. Huh? I'm Remy, and look, you look like you're listening to me. Wait, you understand me? Of course, I can understand everyone here. I'm Morph. You don't usually see rats in the kitchen. <laughs> True, but I happen to be the chef of this restaurant. And before you ask, we pass all our health inspections. Sorry, I didn't mean it like that. Oh. I know. I know, it's fine. Anyway, no time to talk. Oh. The dining room's filling up and most of my staff's out sick. Plus, there's a food critic visiting tonight and I gotta make a good impression. If he gives our food a bad review, it'll be a disaster. Critics are the worst. <laughs> Some, sure, but every now and then you find one who really gets food, and that can change your life. Mm. Have you ever worked in a kitchen before? Uh, yeah, I'm a master chef. <laughs> Good to know, but uh -huh. right now I need you to wash dishes. What? Ever heard of a dishwasher? Yes, and ours is broken. The repair person will be here tomorrow. But for now, it's sink, water, soap, and elbow grease. Thanks! Dishwashing. Where do I do- where's your sink, Remy? Ah, dirty dishes. Okay. Let me track the right quest. Use your watering can and wash the dirty dishes. Laziest dishwasher ever. Right, that's clean. Oh yeah, I totally cleaned the dishes. Mm -hmm. There we go. All done. Bonjour. Clean dishes, fantastic, thank you. As long as you're still here. How do you feel about cooking? Cooking is an art. Oh. I agree. The way the flavors sing when they go together, it's like music. Huh? When you craft a whole meal, it's like composing a symphony. Yeah. But just like art, it takes practice. Let's do it. Yeah. We're preparing a couple of dishes. One with fish, one with fruit. Ah. Find the ingredients around the kitchen. Oh, I actually really yourself. like how they've done cooking in this game. Let's take uh, some onion, oregano, oh, and the rest. Basil, corn, butter, wheat. What else have you got? Ooh. Eggplant, un banana, 
rainbow trout. Oh, my pockets are full. Well, that's not helpful. Find a fish and prepare a meal using it. Oh no, the one thing I was supposed to get and I was picking up everything else. There we go. Don't worry, the floor's clean. Now it is. There we go, it's all clean. A rainbow trout. I'm guessing that's the fish you wanted me to prepare. Bloop. <laughs> Look at him. He's like, ah, oui. What's fish in French? Oh, I feel like I know it. What, isn't it poisson? Something like that? Or is that chicken? Or is that poulet? Oui, poisson. 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 Les poissons. Poisson, croissant. A fishy croissant. What do you think, Remy? Grilled fish. Show Remy what you made. Hey, it's you! That's a perfect presentation. You really understand complimentary flavors. Duh. <laughs> it's a great start. Let's not get ahead of ourselves here. Huh. Let's see if you can do it again. This time with fruit. Thanks. Fruit. Where'd you keep the fruits? Ooh. Apples. I'm gonna take some milk. I call this apple milk. I made a shake. I made an apple milk shake. Do you like this? I'm impressed. You've got talent, Morph. Clearly, you know your way around the kitchen. Evidence, your two dishes. Huh. But we need to hurry. The food critic is getting impatient out there. Are you ready to make something a little more complicated? I'm here to help. Mm. And I really appreciate that. Mm. Because I need you to make a three-course dinner. It'll be tonight's Prix Fix. Prix Fixe. And you, hey, you can design it. Choose an appetizer, hearty salad, or bell pepper puffs. Let's go with the bell pepper puffs. You'll need a bell pepper, some cheese, and an egg. Bell pepper, cheese, egg. I think I had like a mission to make bell pepper puffs. I'm not sure um, if that's still a thing, if it was a daily thing. Um, well, so that was bell pepper, cheese, egg, an oof. Bell pepper puffs. Yo, those look delicious. Though. What is that? Peppers wrapped in cheese? Or cheesy peppers in omelette or something? There you go. Hello! Look at this appetizer you created. Look at this experience you created. Uh -huh. Each flavor is unique, but the way you've combined them creates something new. And it's not always about innovation. Sometimes you evoke the past. Food can bring back memories. The school cafeteria. Yuck. <laughs> yes. You can also evoke memories of bad food. Let's avoid that. For our main course, we have a pizza margarita. Or a vegetable casserole. Or let's make pizza. Uh, uh -huh. Spices and adjust the flavor. You work well as a team. Pizza base. It's its own thing. Find the cookbook. Ah, I need the recipe first. There we go. I can't use it, but it says ingredients: wheat, tomato, and cheese. Wheat is here. Tomato. 
Oh. And hopefully we have space to grab some more cheese. No. More for the floor. I'm gonna enjoy that milkshake. Oh, I'm not allowed to eat, apparently. Okay. Oh, I needed that tomato. Whoops. Okay, now we get the cheese. Improve the pizza recipe by adding spices or herbs. Listed in the recipe from the book. Didn't say any recipes there, but I guess I could uh, throw some basil on a pizza. Like, that makes sense, right? So it was cheese, wheat. Uh, Remy, can I make a wheat free pizza, please? I'm actually gluten free. Uh -huh. Get out. Ooh, I don't think I've made a four star yet. Nice. I spent a bit of time the other night cooking with Mickey. Ah, there you go. Give. Why can't I... What? Do you want to give these items? Yes, give these items. What are you doing, me? Why, Why is this not... Is it because I put basil in it? Am I not meant to put basil in it? I make a plain one. Is that wheat? Are you a picky little rat? Have you used the facts of the ingredients here at Infinite and discovering recipes? Yeah, because I think you can just try stuff, right, and find things, mix things together. Probably a good place to come if you have those daily missions because sometimes stuff pops up here to make specific stuff. Why is this not working? Give these items. Recipe pizza, margarita pizza. What? Why are we broken? Improve the basic pizza, adding some spices or herbs. Now I'm back to there. Okay. What do you want from me? Let me just get a few of these. What am I doing wrong? Maybe you need some oregano as well. Inventory's full! this dirt. Drop our apples. Oregano. Basil. Is that the only herb that's in here? I think so. Five star pizza, that is. Damn it. Okay. Bring the main course to Remy. Bonjour. Ah, okay. So I needed oregano in there as well. Oregano. That dish was perfect, but you're not done. The last course is dessert. Ah, the best course. Huh. Desserts are very important. The final taste your customer leaves with. Mm. If we don't offer fabulous desserts, the food critic's gonna roast us. Do you want to bake a banana pie or an apple pie? What would you rather have? I'm going apple pie, always. I don't know if I've ever even had a banana pie, but apple pie? Mm -hmm. Delicious. Classic. For this one, I'll let you work on your own. You'll need three ingredients, and remember, the key to any good pie is butter. Au revoir. Well, I would assume an apple pie is butter, wheat, 
and apples. Would be my guess, Remy. A good apple pie or an apple crumble. Absolutely delicious. Apple. Butter. Sweet. Oh, look at it. How? What would you have with your apple pie? Ice cream is very popular. I honestly, like some people don't like it. I love custard with like an apple pie or like a cake or something. Custard's good, man. But I don't know if that's like a very British thing of like growing up with it. A lot of people think custard's kind of gross, but it goes very well with like an apple crumble or something. Castardo. Here you go. Hey, it's you! The dinner rush has started. <laughs> order up. Someone wants a ranch salad. I'll leave this order to you, but here's a quick hint. Lettuce, tomato, corn. Corn! Bell peppers and onions. Lettuce, tomato, corn. Bell peppers and onions. Oh, I just work sounds. here now. Bell pepper. Lettuce, tomato, zucchini, corn, onions, is that what he said? I guess this is all the questing. Oh, why did I put wheat in there? Whoops. Uh, lettuce, bell pepper, corn, onion, tomato. Whoa, five stars, okay. Order up and one ranch salad and place it in the serving hatch. So you can just come here and like work in the restaurant. That's pretty cool. Hello. The critic is ready for his main course. And of course he ordered my speciality, the ratatouille. Hmm. I'm in the middle of three other orders. Can you help? Prepare Woo! the perfect ratatouille. <laughs> you can do this. It's vegetables and spices and memories. We work well as a team. Prepare and serve a ratatouille. Uh, um, it doesn't. I don't. What, what is ratatouille? What's in a ratatouille? Vegetables and spices. I guess oregano's. Basil? Is there butter in a ratatouille? Uh, zucchini? Probably not lettuce. Maybe eggplant. Oh, inventory's full again. Eh. Inventory's so annoying. How much to expand again? 20,000? I think I am made of coins. I was a ratatouille, I would have a bell pepper in, and I'm probably kind of milky? Maybe. Let's see. <laughs> I don't even know what this dish is. No, no milk. Tomato, bell pepper, onion, zucchini, basil. Oh, wait, that's all of them. Do it. Grilled veggie platter. That's not it. Uh, recipes. Is it here? I think I just have to discover it. Hmm. Let me grab some more ingredients. I think I didn't put butter in. That's probably what was missing. Pizza. Oh, pizza. Want some pizza, darling? Margarita pizza? Delicious. Mmm, chug the milk. Is there eggs? Oh, maybe it's like mostly vegetables? Squash, tomatoes, herbs. Eggplant ratatouille. Zucchini. 
Courgette. Onion. Let's see if we can get the right combo. The music's really nice in here. Let's try tomato, eggplant, zucchini, and basil, and onion. <gasps> I did it! Oh my god, second try! Look at that, it was just veggies and some herb. Ratatouille! What does this mean? Does this mean I bought ratatouille for nothing? Yo, that looks like... What is that? Is that what it looks like? Is this a real dish? Like, ratatouille is a real thing, right? Obviously not ratatouille, where it's like the rat made it, but ratatouille? No? Prepare and serve ratatouille. Here you go. Stewed vegetables. Okay. Do you know what I don't like? Risotto. Hey, it's you! The food critic gave five stars to the ratatouille. What a relief. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah. You know, Morph, you're a very talented chef. Any chance you want to come work for me? Actually, I have a restaurant for you in my village. We can cook together again. I'd like that. We make a good team. Oh. Colette and Linguini can manage without me for a while. You know what? I'll do it. I'll go to your village and I'll help you with your restaurant. Wait, does the job offer come with housing? I can't sleep in the kitchen. Wouldn't be hygienic. I'll definitely need a house before I can go. Nice. This is a really fun little quest. I will go prepare your house. Did I leave anything here that I wanted? I don't think so. Sorry about the mess. Cute. What's your favorite dish to cook? What's your, like, go-to? I'm gonna find somewhere for you to live. I guess you should live by the restaurant. Let's see how big your house is. Remy's house. Wow, that's like a big French townhouse. But I feel like it still makes sense for you to be by the restaurant, I think. We'll put you here for now. The houses are very large. And then probably I should move these things a little bit. I'm a big fan of this building mode. Big fan of the building. Big fan of um, the customization, making your own clothes as well. Really, really great features. There we go. Hopefully that comes out looking good. And we will shall dig this. Bam. And before we move on, I'm just going to empty my inventory really quickly. Direct Earth. <laughs> Moving in a robot and a rat as my first little new friends. Oh, let me plant the uh, carrots here. Beep. Oh, hands. All right, Remy. How much? Greetings, neighbor. Remy may be a wee chef, but he's got refined tastes and grand expectations. If you want a house that's up to his standards, he'll have to pay handsomely for it. Scrooge, you went a bit like sort of Midlands there. Oh, don't you worry, lad. Let's make a big house for a little rat. 2,000 gold. Whoa! <laughs> With such a fine chef around, the valley's economy can really get cooking. All right, you're just really overaking it now. <laughs> wow, that is tall. Remy just blocking out the sun over here.
Ah, picture. Wait, crouch. Remy, come closer. Come up on my shoulder or something. Surely that's something you do, right? Get in the pick. That'll have to do for now. Ooh, a salmon rice dish. Nice. I haven't seen that. Well, here's Remy. Wow, this place is beautiful and familiar. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Wooly, what's your little plot you wanted to show me? It's okay, you're busy. I'll come back later. Sorry. I almost feel like I've been here before. Weird. Well, no time to think about that now. I have a restaurant to open. Hi, Wooly. Wally. I have something to give to you. A flower. Mm -mm -mm. Is everything okay? Mm. Wally looks a little sad today. I should try and cheer him up. Hey, Wally. You're adorable. Eh. He's looking a little happier. What else can I say? Your work is important. I think I cheered him up. What a cute little wholesome mission that is. Let's see, what do we unlock with Wally? Is that a toolbox or like a lunchbox? Some money? A bicycle? Some wall art from Wally. And then what's that final thing? What is that? A backpack? I think it's a backpack. Um, gardening suits you, Wally. What are you doing back there, Merlin? Oh, it's Scrooge. <laughs> I know we said it on the last stream as well, but someone mentioned how it's like there's no voice acting, but all of the characters just grunt. Like, they just had... They, like, why is 90% of the voice acting that they had people come into the, the voice booth and just... Just, like, make noises but not do any voices? Let's go inside Wally's house. Wow, it's really big in here. You got a bathtub with some plants in it. What are these? Lockers? Nice little sink. Very nice, Wally. We got a chest. Some clothes. And do you have a crafting thing? Oh no, it's just a nice glass table. Very nice. Can't talk to you in here, apparently. What's that? Recipe? Oh, a memory. Oh, a diary entry. All these are a bit hard to understand, but it's worth the effort. That little robot has a big heart, and there's a lot of nuance to his oohs and ahs. Cute. Now we go see the restaurant and Remy's place. Bow, 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 bow. Oh, there you are. Is this it? Is this the only restaurant in the village? Huh. Well, I guess I'm not in Paris anymore. Now, don't get me wrong, there's potential here, it just needs some love. Maybe a complete renovation, but you can help me with that, right? Absolutely. I love food. Thanks. Helps to have someone who, you know... Uh... Measures their height in feet instead of inches, is tall enough to reach the top shelves. Exactly, though there are advantages to being small. For example, I can climb through a hole in the wall and unlock the door from the inside. Follow me. Wow! So many flavors! 
Hello. Bonjour. Should we go in? Uh huh. Yes, the door's unlocked. Thanks. Whoa. Hi, Wooly. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh yeah, let's see what we got from Wooly's place. Brown safety gloves. How very steampunk. And what's in the other bag? Grayish white evening gloves. Nice. Alright. What's going on in here? Where's, uh... Feed an animal around. Wait, why are we still tracking that? Talk to Remy. Bonjour. And it's completely empty. Guess we start with the basics. First up, tables and chairs. I bet Scrooge McDuck sells those. We'll need a lot of them. Let's hope he'll give us a package deal. We uh. work well as a team. I'm getting the vibe of when we played that Animal Crossing expansion and you had to like build a restaurant, build the hospital and all that stuff. diary page. I just had the most amazing meal at Remy's really outdone himself with the menu. He's talking about expanding the dishes based on all the different parts of the valley. So that's why he remembers being here, because when we were a kid he ran this place. As evidenced by the sign. Alright, get some tables and chairs then. Buy a restaurant furniture kit. From Scrooge. 